Hello guys, today I want to demonstrate you a demo project of one of the versions how to solve a particular problem. The Laracus forum post is asking for basically repeating transactions, repeating jobs based on user behavior. Typical example I would say is a newsletter or some campaign to be sent on behalf of the user. So imagine you're building something like MailChimp, Mailgun, mail coach or whatever is the mailer. How would you structure that tasks for every user? I will show you again one of the options and it's a very simplified option. You can go much more optimized, but with that I want to raise the discussion. How would you do that? What are your tips? And let's focus on the comments in this video. My way is very, very simplified. And from that, from the starting point, we can discuss further. So you imagine you have a system of newsletters with this database structure. Newsletter belongs to users and I've seeded some data and there's send time for each newsletter. And then each newsletter has recipients with emails. So basically at the time of the send time, we need to send that many emails to those people. Of course, in real world, it's much more customized, but this is to simplify everything. And this is again, one way to do that. In your scheduler, in App Console Kernel, you could run a job every minute. So every minute, the job would check if there's anything to send at that particular minute. And to run that scheduler, of course, you need to have cron job on the server. And I will link in the description below the documentation how to set that up. But then every minute, basically, this job will happen. It will search for newsletters where null started at sending, but send time is already like now or a minute ago. And then for each of those newsletter, it would run a specific job dispatch, a job for that specific newsletter, which probably should be put into the queue. And if you're not familiar with the queues and how they work, it's totally out of topic of this short video. I have a separate course on queues in Laravel. Again, I will link that in the description below. So it dispatches a job for a particular newsletter. And then within that newsletter first, it marks the newsletter as started and then dispatches all the individual emails with the recipient email and with the newsletter mailable class. Again, this class is very simplified with static text, with subject and content of newsletter blade, which is just the text of the email, nothing really fancy without any attachments. So I wanted to show you the logic, the possible logic. If you have small amount of data, this probably could work without too much optimization. But if we go into optimization, probably the first thing I would optimize is this one. So mail to individual emails could be probably grouped into some kind of campaign. For mail, of course, you can use and you should use external service provider like Mailgun or similar. I use Mailgun personally, but here, instead of sending individual newsletter, I would probably vote for some kind of campaign based system like MailChimp or MailCoach. Actually, a lot of those systems support both campaign and transactional emails. But my point is to group all those campaigns into one job, into one API call to some external system. And then you actually offload that work and you don't care what happens next. So it's outside of your Laravel application, which makes your application ready to tackle more jobs the next campaign. So yeah, that's pretty much it for my version of how to implement this task. And now let's start the discussion. In your experience, would that approach fail and why? And how did you approach that in a better way? Let's discuss together and share our knowledge with the other viewers of this YouTube channel. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.